Hey, what is going on, you guys? It's Stupid Player Negative AE, and welcome to Vigante. Um, so there's a couple reasons why I want to play Vigante. Is two, or is two? I just skipped the first one because fuck that. Uh, no, one. I want to uh, get back into Vigante here coming in the coming weeks because I want to. I realize the reason why I get frustrated sometimes is because I'm not necessarily the best at the game yet, and uh, you know, you play something long enough and you feel like you should be, and. Uh, that's how I feel with Vagante. It's like I've played it so long that I should be the best, but I'm not the best yet. But everybody learns at a different pace. Also, new Halloween update coming today. Or not coming, but it's here. Halloween update. Also, slimes act differently. Uh, I don't know what patch this was, because I, you know, I took this huge break. But slimes dash at you here. Let's see if I can get another slime, and I'll show you guys. Uh, that's fine. What do the gloves do? You always know if it's going to be a good one. So I usually go Holy uh, because the 4 is really good, but I feel like Holy is less good now because of this. Uh, it, it's very helpful, and as long as you have healing items, it will do shit, but it it doesn't have the same feel uh, for me. So I'm going to go ahead and go in Defense Tree uh, so I can get Aspect of Steel. Aspect of Steel is uh, highly underrated, I think, and I think that if I can get to max level in this defense path, I think it'll work out in my favor. <laughs> that being said, I never, I freaking, I never get past like what, forest level one. I played the other day with my friend uh, Corey just to see. Okay, so slimes, so they jump whenever they are like that, and then they do a dash like that. Do you see that? Insane, insane in the membrane. Insane, got no brain. All right, um, wow, coated with poison, ring of cell talk. Is really good. I don't have a hundred dollars, a hundred gold. This man, this man is tripping if he thinks I have anything for him. So this is a bad situation that I could make good. Okay, good. Okay. Um, was there anything over there that I need to go back for? I don't think so. I got a bomb, though, which is really helpful. Bombs are, like, give or take helpful because... Oh, that's, that's why I didn't want to be in that corner. Hmm. <coughs> Here, let me turn this down on my end. There we go. Um, but yeah, the bombs, bombs are like a double-edged sword, right? Like, you could royally screw yourself with the bomb but uh, but will you is the question like I can kill dragon right now I'd rather take the uh, the throw hard rather than the increased what archery that I'm never gonna use I love that slimes do a dash now it makes slimes like more more tolerable because before when they used to jump, they used to be exactly like spiders. Where they would jump and then they would like land on top of you sometimes. Um, and I, I don't, I, I hate spiders. So I'm glad that it's not like spiders anymore. Even though spiders are still a bane of my existence because they poison you. Ooh, I didn't. I didn't think the bomb was gonna blow up that fast. I thought I had more time to to jump up to the next ledge, uh, but I did not. That was uh, it was risky of me. It's fine. <clears throat> you could royal, like I said, you can royally fuck yourself with the bomb, and I, I almost did. So, you know, uh, we our next goal is to find the door. If we can find the door, I think we're good. We we have a key, uh, which is no doubt on the other side of this piece of shit. Right? Like, we didn't find the... Wait, is that... Wait, is the key up... 
Oh, that's the shop. That's the entrance. That's the shop. Okay. Uh, I was looking at the map. I was, I was trying to remember what the symbols mean. Um, I, I know what they mean now. Whew, I'm glad I got that. That hit right. There we go. Not too bad. We just kind of wanted to have that fall into place. Well, so we can go like that. I've been thinking about a strategy where I just don't get those items, but then uh, a regen potion could be in one of those uh, chests. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I defeat the first three bosses of this area, and then I go to, like, the catacombs, and I don't want to fight any bosses in the catacombs because they do way too much damage, right? So I just save all the keys that I get from here for there. Uh, but that would mean that I would have to survive without any potions, because usually potions only drop from the, the boxes and barrels and shit. So you would need to, like, that's the thing, is, like, you would need to find a way to not take any damage and then rely completely on fairy, I guess. So we should have fairy on this floor. I don't know where she's going to be. I have to be careful and watch out for her. Uh, hopefully the enemies didn't just ruin my chances just there with that, that shit. Um, I'm glad I went that way so I wouldn't have to come all the way back. Uh, night, night is definitely easy to handle as far as, um, ooh. I like, I like him being right there, because I can just, when he comes around, I can just be like, pop. Oh, it's a mimic. Hello. We got a Cestus. Uh, Cestuses are great right now. Or at least they were. I don't know. They, maybe they nerfed him. Oh, wouldn't that, that have been an uproar, huh? If they nerfed. Cestus damage to gold minus the strength. I don't like the minus the strength. I'm gonna keep my regular sword The whole reason I take strong is to have more strength Do I have a thing that decreases strength? No, it's just my normal strength is high <clears throat> All right, so I have this I have this I have this what is this boulder protection? All right good to know and we have book a portal so we could easily steal from the shop if we needed to if we needed to. I don't want to steal from the shop and then... And then just be completely shafted. By the other... See? Like, that's really cool. That is so cool to me. Wow, and this is a very cool invisible wall space. There we go. Alright, so I want to get this, if at all possible. Frame rate drop right there, Jesus. Alright, um, animal skin. That's good because we don't have damage reflection. Awesome. I love it. Anytime we can uh, do unto others as they do to us is a good idea. In fact, a great idea. It's... It is worm boss uh, this time around, so we're going to have a little bit of trouble since we have no way of dealing with worm bosses tonight. Uh, that's part of the reason why I hate him so much. I need a, I need like a fast attack speed item that's not the Cessus that I have, because the Cessus that I have lowers my strength. <laughs> that is so awesome to me. I think I need that. Excuse me, sir. I think I need that. <laughs> Did you just dash at me? Oh, you fuck. Oh, you fuck. There we go. Man, and the and the spike turns into like a or slime turns into like a spike ball when he hurts you. You, you guys see that? Alright, um... <clears throat> there's another bomb. I would like a bomb. Ooh, the crossbow. I'm never gonna use the... Ooh. Okay. We're buying the claw. Claws are the most overpowered thing in the game right now. I don't know if they've changed it. I don't know. I don't know how fast... I don't know. Maybe, maybe they nerfed its attack speed. But its attack speed was overpowered. 
And for the amount of damage that it, there's no damage fall off for the attack speed, it's just the same as the Cestus, except faster. It's, it's like the same damage as the Cestus, but faster. And I think even more damage. Yeah, just a little bit more. Like, here's the Cestus, one to two. Claw does more, has more attack speed. It doesn't look like it, but the, I don't know. Maybe they have the same. Maybe I'm talking out my ass, but I'm pretty sure that the, uh, the claw has the. Fuck you and your 12 damage. It's one of those guys. There we go. There we go. Oh. I freaking. I was playing the tube the other day and. Freaking. We, we always play one song, right? Tube is really easy. It's an easy instrument uh, as far as, as technical goes. Right? It's hard to get the embouchure to play it, and it's hard to get the breath support to play it. But once you get those two things down, oh, I'm glad I got this claw just in time for Worm Boss. Of course, Worm Boss is going to try his hardest to be the biggest dick that he possibly can. Because he's Worm Boss. Oh, but he killed everything on that on that uh, that floor up there. That's really good. I'm glad that I got some damage off on him. I want some vertical movement. There we go. Okay. Oh, your shot went through the wall, really? Okay. Uh, uh. He's just stalling. He's just stalling the inevitable. Even when I come down here, he's like, yeah. <sighs> Fuck you. Coming way down here. Motherfucker still comes up through there. Motherfucker doesn't. <sighs> Fuck you. Oh my goodness. Fuck this guy. <sighs> yeah, I know. Come out of the same exact spot. No, okay. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I really want them to change this boss. Come on. No, just die for me, please. Oh. Oh, you're coming now? Fuck you. No. <sighs> and if I mess up, I, I don't get a second shot. I accidentally hit the ceiling, so I couldn't get to him in time. <sighs> Alright, you freaking motherfucker. Come on. There we go. Fucking finally. Like, two minutes of my life right there. Alright, where is shop? I bought the thing from the shop guy. I got the key now, so that means I can go up here. Boom. We got two black potions and a hammer. A uh, fairy should be on this floor. I don't know where, but she should be on this floor. Also, the door is down there anyway. This man is gonna freaking murder me. There we go. Hey, there's Fairy. Especially a shocking claw. I cannot believe that we have a shocking claw. Alright, so I think we take this and go, unless there's an enemy in here, which there's not. I'm gonna take the cross amulet. 
Okay, and then we're just gonna leave. Cool. So we have fairy. Fairy wasn't in the water, which is helpful for me. We're gonna equip. Uh, um, this is underwater breathing dexterity, cold resist. Berserkitis, vitality. Um, I like the vitality, so I'm gonna keep it on. Time for bulwark. So now I just take less damage, uh, which is helpful for me. Helpful for me. What was I talking about with the tuba earlier? I don't remember. Oh, I was talking about how it was an easy instrument and how like you need the breath support and shit to to play it, right? Um, but like, uh, you st you also need to have like the. I don't, I don't know what what the word I'm looking for is the like the finesse, the like when you play a note like it can't go and then you play the note because like that that little like part before you play the note it, it like you you can hear it and the aud the audience is gonna know this place feels a little spooky um so okay so yeah yeah Halloween update first of all before I get into that whole story um freaking the Halloween update adds some crazy shit right shit you would never believe fuck you slime fuck you when you're slime as shit there we go it adds a couple things uh, there's an area and I'll show you the area I think it's really cool There we go. There we go. It gives you a cool like item too. It's really cool. This this item is so good. This freaking claw. This claws are so overpowered. Minus two strength I can't handle. Uh it was a good a good try though. Good try, though. Look at that shit. Look at that shit. Look, 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 look at that shit. Look at that shit. We, we over here killing everybody. Okay, so this is the spooky shit. There we go. So this is the spooky shit. Uh, it, it happens when you walk near it, uh, which I just did. Uh, and let me book a portal. I'm just taking assets here. Okay. So it happens over here. And when you come over here, let me get rid of this Gorgon Eye because he's being a dig. When you come over here, there's like a bunch of there's a bunch of things going on over here. There's a bunch of graves and shit. Skeleton comes out of the ground. You're like, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> That's me and my friend were online. We're like, what the fuck is this? He gives us candy. So the ja jack o' lanterns gives us candy. So we want to wait for the jack o' lanterns because the candy does crazy shit. Like if we eat it makes us run super fast and we can attack super fast as well it's really cool and then there's this ghost this is the last guy we get candy we'll probably take one more and then we'll fuck off There we go. 
We're, we're pretty strong with the claw already. I don't understand if we... There we go. I don't know if we really need to be fighting anything, but this is cool. It's too spooky for me, so I'm gonna have to... Straight up Castlevania skeleton over here. It's too spooky for me, so I'm gonna have to take off. But I want this candy, so... There we go. Good. If jack-o'-lanterns spawn, I'll take it. But yeah, that's the Halloween thing. It's really cool. I wouldn't have had it any other way. And it gives you an item. That's all I can ask for. Anything that gives me anything. It's pretty good. You didn't die by spikes, but you died by my hands. Honorable. Honorable. Um, but yeah. So you can't really do shit. Oh, yes! You can't really do shit unless you have the finesse to play the notes. And I swear, sometimes when people play the tuba... Like, I can't find good tuba players. Like, I really want to find tuba players that, like, are established and, like, do concerts for a living. I can find them with anything else, right? The only thing I can find under, um, tuba, uh, players is tuba Peter. And that's it. That's all there, all there was. And then, like, people do in there, I want to buy that just so I can find out what, what color the regen potion is. Okay, so it's cyan. Oh, uh, which is fine. Fine with me. Are we out? We out. We out. Alright, so we're in the forest. Uh, I'm gonna do this. Correctly time blocks will negate uh, reflect damage. Uh, which, is, which will be helpful. I'm hoping to block a lot in here. Uh, just press down and you you block so I'm hoping hoping that I can block everything the spider AI is too smart the spider AI is like too smart for shit Freezing aura is help very. Ooh, so is the crossbow. This is 101, so we won't be able to afford both. We should also probably have a bomb, because we have none. A bomb would be necessary for Golem Boss. So if we buy this, then this, that comes out to 100 and something, 140 something. So we can buy both of these, which I think is a better trade than the vitality and the luck that that gives. And we already have, uh, I mean, it's a poison resist item, so. We'll get the bomb for, for Golem Boss. We'll, we don't really have anything to deal with Golem Boss, so we have to get, like, at least two, three bombs to deal with him. So we have one. Um, yeah, we have one. So, let's hope that we can get more. <gasps> Fire wand is a blessing from above. Oh my. Oh. Fire wand is a blessing. Alright, so there's our golem boss uh, destruction. We should probably also find a scroll of recharge. That's a scroll of uncurse. Good to have. Scroll of recharge. Good. So now we have 11 charges on that shit. Um... Oh good, we we did something there. You darn right I blocked that shit. You darn right I blocked that shit. Can't give me no spider webs because I just blocked the whole time. Yeah, you can't jump on my head when there's a freaking block above it, can you? You stupid. <laughs> it's it's weird. My phone my phone blows up way more than it used to. 
My phone, my phone, like... My phone, for some reason, has way too many buzz sounds for every little thing. Like, I know if it's a text message, I know if it's a other thing, because it buzzes differently. <laughs> um, like, for example, that was a Discord message. Fuck you and your 10 damage. Oh, and you and your 2 damage. I don't like that guy at all. There we go. I don't like that flying guy at all because he stays at a distance from you. So, like, defeating him is quite literally impossible. Hopefully we don't fight Golem Boss right now. I would like the chance to get another bomb before we do that. Got another regen, which is actually really helpful. Four of them now. We haven't we haven't been needing them, so uh, as long as we we still don't need them, I imagine we will after this first boss. You always do after the first boss. All right, so we don't have the key yet because we have to fight Va boss. Hopefully, it's not Vine boss either. Uh, Vine boss is almost just as tough. No, it's Wisp Boss. Good. It's the boss that I wanted, actually. Fuck you. Stupid Spriggan. Trying to get the jump on the competition. Yeah, fucker. You can, like, F yourself. Oh, good. There we go. Uh, how much health did we lose? Not very much. Not very much. Uh, is is we could have lost less, but the the spriggans were attacking us from the side. There wasn't much that we were gonna do about that because we we had you have to take Wisp Boss out, otherwise Wisp Boss becomes so much of a problem. Hey, and there's the second bomb we're looking for. Yeah, we are getting we getting real real end gamey here and considering we'll have aspect of steel on uh, next level and we'll be able to block some attacks we can use those uh, potions to work those regen potions all right so I think that's everything we have to go Ooh. There we go. Um, so I, I want to get... I, I don't know if I want to save this key or not. I probably don't. Okay, glass blade isn't helpful for us. We're not going to be using a glass blade. We have, we have, we already have a claw with shocking and strength. There's no nothing that can convince me to equip another weapon with like that is anything else. Um. We, have, we do have a bunch of potions though and our strength is nine our strength is nine without anything without uh, a strength potion without anything so that's that's really good that is really good and I come through here good in here uh, and then level ourselves up for aspect of steel so now we're at max defense I think our next goal is to go all vitality uh, which would be helpful. And now that we're block knight, we're we're basically block central. We have to. A lot of the times you gotta cancel your auto attack, which is why it's helpful for. Fuck. That's why it's, it's helpful for like uh, boss fights and shit. And the claw, like if you have the claw. I can't imagine that you fail because you can just cancel the claw right into the block. There we go. Get that. We want all the gold that we can because shopkeeper might have something good here. Uh, vines are dangerous. I have feather fall, which could be helpful. Vines are dangerous, but if we if we can get to them in time, and 
There we go. Oh, I'm full on inventory. Uh, let me let me discard some shit that I don't need. Oh, you, I should have freaking gone to the smithy, shouldn't I? I should have gone to the smithy. There was a smithy on that floor, and I didn't go to him. I I shit the bed. Uh. <laughs> that being said, um. That's not good. That's not good. We'll come back if we find a smithy and we'll throw those items in. Uh, let's, oh, good. It's fine, boss. All right. So, at this point, I'm going to pop a regen uh, because I want to be at max. Ooh, and he's surrounded by spiders. Great. Let's, let's take out the spiders first. What? <gasps> Whoa. Okay. Oh, they updated him. Okay, he's been updated. Vine boss has been updated. Yikes, I don't know if I like that at all. Like he was already tough. <laughs> like, like I, I, you need to power through him in order to do anything. Cold is just minus two strength. I can't have that right now. Cell talk would be, is very helpful. Um, mm, mm, mm. Frost Nova uh, is the most helpful spell probably in the game. Yikes. Can I do this? I, I don't have a death protection for this. Uh, Lifesteal, uh, spirit emitter, strength, coated with poison. Oh, all of these are good. Oh, jeez. This makes me this makes me happy. Uh, let's let's see what we can do with it. Actually, I might want to have the shocking more than I would have that, just because the shocking puts that extra damage on there. Life steal will make me last longer, but last longer in a fight that. This, this motherfucker with the shit. I just need to fight him with all those spiders. Alright, let's go. Okay, <laughs> I can't I can't frost while I'm berserking, which I noticed while I was in that fight. You can also, um, it, you could also see that I was frost nova. I frost nova the spiders up there, so I could fight him down there. Uh, and then a spriggan jumped into the battle, which I was not prepared for. Um, so I just didn't pay any mind to him, and he died anyway. So it's helpful. Um, we're gonna get rid of this. Or this. No, we're getting rid of this, just because we won't use that ever in our entire lives. The other one we might use. Yellow potion, I don't know what that does. We could probably just chug a bunch of potions and see what all of them do. Why straight after me, dude? It's like straight after me. He didn't even like take a detour, he's like, ooh, there's a guy there. Uncurse is good to have. A death becomes easier to counter is not good to have. I wonder if there's been a player that like got e death becomes easier to counter and then immediately died after equipping it, but not knowing what it was because he was just trying to equip shit. Yo, freezing Cestus though. 
The the shocking claw is good, but a freezing cestus. Oh no, what do I do, guys? Oh, uh, I think I go with the freezing cestus just because. Oh no, what do I do? Freezing cestus is so good. Cause it'll freeze it'll freeze them in place so they can't counterattack. But then I guess the, the 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 shocking stuns them, right? <sighs> I'm thinking I really have enough vitality. I think I think my, my goal here is to just keep going after strength. Now that it's at a ridiculously high level, I think I go even more into it, right? So I have like more strength. I want to do as, um, as much damage as possible in the freaking shortest amount of time. DPS. DPS, DPS, I say. So I'm going to go up top. Up top is usually the safer way to do things is the shop. He hides in a treehouse for some reason. This is what we're getting at the end at the end of this level. I cannot forget this. This is by far the best robe we have. Uh, especially for the fourth world, we literally can just skip past everything and win the game. This is an end game. This is an end game game right here. The game has been has given us everything that we need. If I fuck up, it's on my own accord. Because this is a perfect run. Uh, now we haven't gotten death protection. The only thing that can make this run better is if we, it's like, hey, here's death protection. I know you didn't need it, but you know, we felt like being nice to you today. Uh, let's get rid of this. We have another uncurse, so let's see what this is. Uh, no. I'm gonna go ahead and get that, put that back on, get the poison resist. Do, I, do we have max poison? No, we have two poison. Uh, I was gonna say, we haven't been poisoned yet in my head, but I didn't say it and then I immediately got poisoned right after I thought it in my head. Like, my brain was like, yeah, uh, how about that, huh? Too bad I block things. I block things! Okay, this motherfucker's gonna be stupid. Oh, he's a, he's a quest motherfucker. I gave him money. I don't know what that money does necessarily. Although I do want to go back because there's a sh the the shop had a the shop had a thingy in here. And uh, we just get rid of our current thingy. Because damage reflection is good, but not as good as unlimited jumps. Plus the vitality makes us a little bit stronger. We can literally just float across the entire map now. Oh, that, that could be a death protection, guys. We're not using that ever. Flame War defense compared to that. I like the defense. We need, we need as much defense as possible. We have a good amount of defense right now, uh, so we don't really need to worry about it too much. Uh, but yeah, freezing cestus is so good. And with Featherfall, it's like we can just do this forever. <laughs> like, Featherfall makes it so I don't even have to time my jump. Because that's how, that's how f I, I don't even fall very far. <laughs> uh, these shoes, oh my goodness, plus unlimited jump, where literally, do we have, we probably have a magic mapping somewhere. Uh, we're probably going to be using that. 
uh, for the fourth world. All right, so we have two bombs. Uh, let's equip it. I want to wait for the spider to get his ass over here. Oh, jeez. Okay. <gasps> Whoa. I'm glad that it was the teleport effect. I accidentally destroyed that statue. Good. Yo, did you see the auto block? Yo, auto block was doing work. Did you? Oh my goodness! Yo, Defense Knight, it has a new has a new place in my heart right there, right there. That was so good, so lucky. I'm so lucky. That that auto block is so good. Awesome. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad that I I decided to go this today. Uh, we're not using the hammer ever. If we find the smithy, we'll use it. But I haven't found him yet. I do have flame aura up in this. A and another potion of regen plus the shrunken head, which gives us death protection, which is the final shit. It's a minus of vitality, but really death protection is worth everything and then some. Really, I don't care if it gives me negative everything, right? Death protection just kind of nullifies all of that because once it's gone, it's you you don't have to worry about it anymore. I think we're good as far as everything goes. Berserk Itis was nice, right? But we don't necessarily need it. Um, Jesus. Yeah, wow. This has been a good run so far. Let's go. Let's get it in. Let's get it. Let's get it. All right. So this is the catacomb. I don't want to hurt him because I know he goes ape shit. Uh, and then I'm going to. Ooh, I should drop books in the fire. Does he get mad at me if I just burn him? He does. He does. I want to kill him. I want to see what he has. I want to see if I can kill him. Oh, I desperately want to kill this guy. <laughs> this man with the jumps. <laughs> this man knows how to fight in Vigante. Or knows how mobs fight, at least. How is this man not dead? How much health does this guy have? He must have like 999 health. <laughs> That's, well, I got nothing for him, so. Um, so. Let's go. Let's get it. Uh, I don't think we equip any armor that's not an oh auto block. That's a mimic over there. All those would be good.
Yo, somehow I made it past that. Let's quaff a regen potion real quick. We found the door, we out. We're gonna treat this like a like a Vagante run that we don't care. Even though it's the easiest uh, catacombs boss. I, I don't know. Don't quote me on anything I say. I think that's the easiest catacombs boss just because he's the weakest. Uh, you can literally just Rambo him when, while he's summoning shit, but he does teleport around, so if you can't get him in the first couple seconds, uh, he will teleport to, like, a level above you, and then you have to run to go, uh, get him again. Uh, which is, uh, dumb, to say the least. Uh, but... That's the hardest boss, in my opinion. Uh, but, you know, what are you going to do? We are doing so well. <laughs> um, we, we can stand to defeat some stuff in the fourth world so we can level up. But other than that, I think we just keep playing our, our run game over here. And the, ooh, shit. Auto block is saving my ass. So there's the death protection. Way too many hands. Way too many hands. Way too many of everything, actually. Way... There we go. This is gonna be a problem. Okay. Alright, fourth world, that's fine. I give a shit. I give a shit. Uh, we st we didn't even use the fire wand to defeat golem boss. We used our pure shit, so we can use that to defeat a boss here. We're going to quaff our regen potion, uh, and then we're going to use our magic mappings on the fourth world. Uh, hopefully we have magic mappings. Hopefully we got every scroll, and this is the one with magic mapping. Yes! Great. Alright, so that's going to magic map the whole area up to the top left, which means we'll be able to find our way out immediately, which is right there. Cool. So then, uh, what we do, since we have unlimited jumps with this, and then we have feather fall with this, uh, we win. It's basically, it's basically we don't care about the layout of the map, we don't care about the, the other shit. All we care about is getting to that exit. What? was I going to do? Oh yeah, I want one more vitality just for shits and giggles. So we just hop on over. I don't need to do anything. We're just enjoying the night sky. And it's like right around here, right, is where the exit is. And we just fall. And there's the boss. Hi. See ya later. We've, we, uh, it's been a while since I've beaten the game. So I think it's really cool that, uh, I come back to the Halloween update and I do it again. Uh, where's the exit this time around? All the way to the left side of the map. I don't want to upset the boss who is right there. This man is in the way of the door. Thank you. That man was like, yeah, I'm going to just stand in front of the door, baby. And then you won't be able to do anything. That's fine. I won't let him get in the way of my, my victory.
And then we magic map this area. We find out where the exit is. Which is directly below us. That man is hiding in the wall. GG, motherfucker. GG. Um, so yeah, that's the end of Agate. That was the Halloween update. This has been interesting. Um, I think we just loop it and then, you know, play as reckless as possible now. Um, it's, it's something to be said that that knight with claw is, is insane. Claw is just insane, in my opinion. I think the reason we won is because we got really lucky with the, with the items. Over most of the items that I got lucky getting, uh, I didn't even use. I didn't, I didn't even use half those items. Why wow, the slime still die at the same, same, same rate. Um, I didn't end up using, like, for example, I still have this fire wand. Uh, did I use the bombs? I think I, I used the bombs. I used the bombs on, on golems, right? There's the smith. I mean, really, we could use the smith. Uh, let's just go. Bob. Bob. Uh, Bob. He grants me that gift. I'll equip it. It's not very good, uh, but I'll take it. Uh, what is this? Boomerang attacks will sometimes be frozen. None of them are good. I'd take the bomb, but really, uh, I don't think we're going to get to the forest on the second loop unless we just loop it twice, uh, which could happen. I've done it before. It does not seem like the type of run where I'll do that, though. So this guy can now spawn like multiple shits. So I have to kill him as fast as possible. There we go. He can spawn multiple waves of those guys and if once you once you get into it it becomes super stupid. I'm not going to open this chest uh, mainly because it doesn't have anything good in it. It's still the same chest rewards on the loop. So you want to you want to save all your keys at, uh, this time around for sure. <laughs> I'm nervous about Worm Boss. He's gonna have like double the health or some shit. Auto block is also helping a lot. We're just playing as risky as possible, and the fire is uh, healing us. Wow, 25 damage, really, really. Fairy is unhappy because Dragon is sitting on her. Cool. Good to know Dragon still has the same health. Uh, we'll take Fairy here in a second as soon as we find the exit. Oh, Jesus Christ. Ow. If we can even get past this without dying. Wise man's beard. Uh, let's see what it does. What do we got here? Unbounded sight. I mean, it's objectively better. It gets rid of a vitality, though, which I'm not happy with on the fourth level. Alright, so we found the shit. Let's go get the fairy. And uh, we'll, we'll take off immediately. Fuck you! Oh, he, they hit him off. They hit her off at the last second, like while I was going through the door. Stupid. Okay, well, that's fine. It's not like I wanted fairy anyway. I didn't want fairy. Got how many? Got how many enemies extra they throw? 
<laughs> the, 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 like they, they threw like way more enemies the second round. That's cool. I like that. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you hit that like button. Subscribe if you feel necessary. And uh, psh, what else was I going to say at the end of this? I hope you guys are having the best <laughs> rest of your day. Um, yeah, welcome back to Vagante. I might be playing this a lot more, especially with um, all the new stuff that came out that I don't know about, like all the rod stuff. I still have to experiment with a bunch of mage uh, builds. But yeah, this... Man, this game, like, going back to it, it makes me feel good. Especially com completing the game when I come back to it. Uh, I love that. Anyway, it's been long enough as it is. Have a good one, you guys, and peace out.